Well, happy Sunday, everybody. As we are waking up on Monday, you're going to be dealing with a dry and clear start to the day. Temperatures into the low 40s in some spots, maybe the mid to upper 40s and others with clear skies. Overall, not too bad of a drive to work or to head out to the bus stop. Those kiddos heading out the door may need a light jacket. 47 degrees the afternoon, though spectacular 72 degrees. Very similar to what we had today, nearly a copy and paste situation. Storm Prediction Center does paint us in the slight risk. That's Threat level two out of five for your Tuesday. Still early here, but something we're watching is that developing threat for damaging winds, maybe some hail as well as a small tornado threat, but still a non zero threat there. As we move on throughout the remainder of your day on Monday, we'll add the clouds and then Tuesday we bring in the rain potentially as early as 7 or 8 a.m. in some areas. Periods of heavier rainfall will be possible with this picking up as we move through the middle of the morning and then again into the afternoon. And it's the afternoon storms that concern me a little more than the morning. The morning does bring the threat of damaging winds, but I'd say the afternoon and evening, if we can recover enough in our atmosphere, it could bring some damaging wind gusts along with hail, possibly some tornadoes as well. So that's one thing to watch for as we go forward for your Tuesday. So keep checking back for the very latest as we'll continue to break that down. Again, right now the threat's looking like wind as your primary issue here out of the four, but hail, wind, and tornadoes may be possible along with flooding as well. And flooding will be more likely in areas that see some of the localized heavier amounts. As you can see, future view rainfall potential about a half an inch to an inch in most communities. Some could see localized heavier amounts as we get throughout the afternoon, and those are the spots where flash flooding is a little more likely, but we don't really know where that's going to be until the moment of 66 degrees for Saturday as we jump ahead to the weekend 70 for Sunday. So you see the warming trend into the weekend. A few clouds both days, maybe a shower both days, but after that, we're looking at a big warm up here or above average stretch for much of the tri state as we look ahead through the middle of May, May 8th through the 15th from the Climate Prediction Center showing warmer than normal temperatures for the eastern half of the country. Now we are in the warming season. I mean, it's pollen seasons here. That may mean a couple of itchy nostrils out there the next couple of days. Oak, mulberry and poplar will be the issues here the next two days. Mostly clear skies, seasonable temperatures to start Monday, Monday afternoon up to 72. Sunshine early, clouds later in the day. So don't be surprised with mostly cloudy skies as you head home from work or as you put the kids to bed. 72 degrees for your Monday, but 76 on Tuesday. And if we make it even higher than that, a better chance for storms coming in. Slight chance at rain on Wednesday and then another chance into the weekend. With warming temperatures, we could be close to 80 next Monday and Tuesday.